okay guys so we have an example four so this first 10 uh, examples are just covering a basic concept that's gonna be in the book and uh, this one is about prophylaxis restriction and provocation so here uh, why, why I just played this move to try to double up on an E file and maybe threaten some checkmate and that's why black played g6 not only uh, preventing any plans of back rank checkmate but also uh, it is uh, takes the f5 and h5 square from the queen or the knight okay then follow rook f to e1 and king g7 so now uh, that uh, black prevented white's plan plans he can concentrate on his own so this is really really powerful if you can uh, restrict any counterplay from your opponent then uh, he is, is not gonna be able to find a plan most likely he's gonna be nervous and then you're gonna just continue with your plans so knight g2 and h5 so this is another concept provocation you're trying to provoke some weaknesses with h4 in in a white camp then h3 so you already provoked a weakness this this is this pawn is now unprotected and can be attacked with tempo uh, probably a lesser evil was to play or probably the lesser the best is to age to play h4 just to stop these kind of ideas and then white has to think about the sacrifice all the time maybe you can sacrifice here and attack the black and white's king something like i don't know something like this and on knight e3 you can play h4 and you already have some attacking prospects so h3 uh, rook d6 we're trying to now attack this weak pawn and knight f4 so maybe better was knight e3 but after c3 takes takes here and then queen goes to d7 attacking with tempo and after queen h4 this is really good i mean this pawn can be protected probably like this but uh, black has really active position okay instead of that knight a4 rook b6 rook b1 c3 b4 and a5 rook e4 but rook d8 so white managed to save the b pawn but now the second rank is really weak vulnerable and uh, here takes actually not takes uh, that, that that is bad move uh, rook b to e1 takes 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 and uh, here f rook e4 queen b2 rook e2 and rook d2 and white resigned here so uh, it is a really good example of how a restriction of uh, your opponent's plans can be really really effective and it can confuse him and and then you can continue with your own plan so these these are really good in a practical games to apply so guys thanks for watching uh, like subscribe and comment and
and uh, see you in the next video.